Hey, oh, look at that. Look at that hair day. That bad hair day is because it's really, really was wind with the wind. Windy. How are you? I hope things have been good. I hope you've been alright. We've got another just one on one video where I'm literally just talking to you. Just talking to the camera. I'm just talking to you. Something that I've been thinking about. Something that's been personally quite a bit on my mind. I actually really quite like these videos where it's just me just talking. Uh, so if you do, <laughs> I will never ever retire. Yeah. Gather round, boys. This is gonna be an emotional video. <laughs> My name is Wada, and I help other young men like me take back control of their lives. I think a lot of us, especially thinking back to when I was in college and then going into the typical nine to five work-life balance, I think a lot of us have this sort of mentality that work is bad, that you're constantly working or you're constantly in school and you're always looking forward to the weekend where you have your day off where you can relax because work is bad, work is tough, you don't enjoy doing hard work. A lot of us have this quite set thinking that work is bad mentality. Don't worry, it's not just you, it, it's me as well. I used to have this a lot. And there was a time where I was working in my nine to five. I had, a, had an accident, so I couldn't work for like two weeks. It's basically a free paid holiday. And even I was injured, I couldn't walk. So I was even excused to do not just like having a holiday off. I could do all the bad habits I wanted to do. I could video game, I could do whatever I wanted, order junk food every single day from like Domino's. I could because I was injured, I was excused. The thing is though, I actually ended up quite enjoying hard work because it got boring. It got very, very boring. And I gave back into the bad habits, a lot of the bad habits I gave back into just because I was actually bored. I think back to this was the moment I actually decided to like make a change and like change my life and it wasn't like a spontaneous moment I just decided that I was just gonna make make a change a difference that I was gonna fix my life take back control you know when I first started getting into like deep work and really hard like tough work and I started changing this work is bad mentality I did not enjoy it I really didn't enjoy it it was hard it was tough Waking up early, meditating, gratitude journaling, going to the gym, and going to the gym after I've had a whole day of work and I'm mentally exhausted. It was really tiring at first and I really didn't enjoy it. Hello, wind. Nah. I really didn't enjoy it. But then after a while, I started to. I really did start to enjoy hard, tough work. And this is why I think I can literally never, I will never ever retire. Because... I feel like I'm always going to be doing something. That this boredom that you get is quite tough. It's worse to deal with, actually. When I'm 60 years old, I'm still going to be going to the gym. I'm probably going to have my own family, achieve all my goals. I'll have my own family, time freedom, location freedom, financial freedom, my own kids. I'm not going to retire and then sit and do nothing. I'm still going to work hard because I enjoy tough work. You know, it's like, it's like cold showers. At first it sucks, but then you start to really enjoy it. And if you actually took away cold showers from me, I would miss it. Same with the gym. I first started going just to be slightly more attractive to the opposite sex, and then I eventually started falling in love with the progress I was making. And if you took away me going to the gym, I probably would be really sad and miss it and bored. I used to think that work is bad, but after being on that sort of routine where I'm getting up early, working hard all day, so where I'm always productive. If I went back to doing nothing and having that work is bad mentality, I don't think I could do it. I think I would be really distraught and depressed. So yeah, I used to have this work is bad mentality, but now if, I, if you took it away from me, I'd miss it. I like always doing something. I've noticed recently myself, like there have been times where I've been bored, you know, like I've got a day off work, it's raining so I can't go skate. The gym is currently closed. And I was sat there bored with nothing to do. I'd finished all my editing for my videos to come out in the next few days. And I was like, you know what? I'm gonna do some more filming. I'm gonna script some more stuff. I'm gonna do some more. I'm gonna do some more YouTube. I'm gonna, I'm gonna film more stuff, do more editing. You know what? The gym's closed that I go to. Yeah, there's one right next to me, two minutes down the road. I'm just gonna go to that one, pay for the day pass. And I have to say this change in mentality is probably one of the best things that 
has come from being on self-improvement for two years. Anyway, I've completely rambled on. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this one-on-one -on -one sesh. And again, I hope, I hope things were good. If you're not subscribed to me, then there's a chance that you will never ever find this channel again. But if you do after this, or you already are, another video will pop up in the corner. And if this video helped you out, you should 100% click on this because this could definitely help you out as well. Stay consistent and do the best you can. You know what time it is? Yeah, we know what time it is. Self-improvement kids. <laughs> Mwah.